Let's get to our forecast this morning. The time now is 549. We're waking up to lots of clouds, but at least those skies are a little drier compared to last night. Here's our KSNT weather cam network out west in Geary County, and uh, you can see the overcast skies. But again, you're dry right now in the northern Flint Hills. On the right-hand side of the screen, that was Heritage Park. Here's our day planner forecast. By 9 o'clock this morning, 73 degrees, so a much cooler pace to those temperatures even this afternoon. By lunchtime, 80, a mix of sun and clouds, and then high temperatures by dinner time, 4.30, uh, even 5 or 6 p.m., around 80 five degrees, maybe a little warmer than that up to the north and a little cooler than that 85 degree mark to the south. All right, here's our KSNT Max Track radar. The brighter the colors, the heavier the rain and really compared to last night, not much left. Just some scattered showers south of the highway. There's Council Grove just to the south and west of you in rural south central Morris County. There's a little popcorn shower there and then down through Cottonwood Falls and Emporia, but el elsewhere in our viewing area, we're pretty much dry. Here's Max Track Radar's estimated rainfall. Anywhere you see the blue color on the screen, that's a solid inch of rain since it started raining last night. And anywhere you see these little purple colors, that's two plus inches. And I was just talking in the National Weather Service in Topeka. We actually picked up 2.19 inches in the buckets at the Billard Airport here in the capital city. So rained really heavily locally, but the northern half of the area, not so much in terms of rain yesterday. Temperatures this morning almost everywhere in the 70s, but notice this temperature trend up north. On Highway 36, places like Seneca, you're in the 60s this morning. It's 64 degrees. Marysville, you've already felt your low temperature of 69. That happened an hour or two ago, and that cooler and more comfortable weather is sliding through as the cold front is completely through. That cold front was last night's weather maker. Here's your forecast today from KSNT Storm Track Weather. Topeka 85. There is still a chance for some isolated showers hours this morning, but we're right now in the clearing and drying out process. In Manhattan this afternoon, 86 degrees. You'll see the sun. In fact, everybody will see the sun before it goes down tonight. Emporia, 84 degrees, cooler and more comfortable, and the timing couldn't be better, especially heading into the upcoming weekend, and especially given the last uh, five or six days, the hot and humid weather we've had. Tonight, we fall back down to 66, maybe some patches of fog. We will be crystal clear, a lot of moisture still close to the ground, but uh, I am expecting if we see any of the fog, only in those fog-prone areas early Saturday. Highs tomorrow afternoon approach 90, but it's all about uh, what's relative and what's the context for this time of the year, Austin. July is a very warm month, so 85 today, 89 tomorrow. Not cold, but cooler relative to what we've been seeing, and it will yes. feel better outside. You will feel the difference. Sunday, all bets are off. We're back <laughs> close to 95 degrees, and then next week, upper 90s with a heat index definitely in the triple digits. There you go. We get a little bit of a break, and yeah. then it gets warm enough to cruise on down I-70, grab yourself <laughs> some of that ice cream, and cool off a little bit. Hey, there you there go. You it's go. that time of the year. That's my plan. The local teens continue.